Hello Youtubers, this is Randomly Cosmotic and I will be doing a little playthrough, walkthrough, whatever you like to call it of my favorite childhood game 102 Dalmatians Puppies to the Rescue So I've skipped the first cinematic which was basically some of Krella's henchmen coming as I think, as I remember, I didn't watch it right now, but I think this was it. Uh, the puppies got whatever they got ca caught or something, and uh, the two puppies that you can play with didn't, so they are the only three puppies that can save the others. Their parents are uh, the the two dogs, the big dogs. I don't know what their names are. Whatever. They're caught as well, so the life of all the puppies and their parents is in well, dominoes and whatever the other puppy's name is hands, paws, whatever. So, this is the first level, Regent's Park, and I will randomly say things throughout the video that will help you, but I will keep my voice down when there are dialogues and things like that and if you hear random things around my house it's not my fault maybe my parrot is going to say something or whatever so let's start oh and uh, here you can see that you can get 100 bones on each level and six puppies I usually like to get all of them so whatever you get stickers which is are in this thing and mini games look we have golf mini golf so let's start. Hello there, puppy. Name's Waddlesworth. Welcome to Regent's Park. Hi, Waddlesworth. Waddles I'm looking for my brothers Wolf. and sisters. I think they may be in trouble. Can't yes, pronounce it. Cruella de Vil has sent out an army of robotic toys to capture all the pets in England. But why? What is she going to do with them? The robots are locking the pets into crates like this one and taking them to Cruella's toy factory outside of London. Can we stop them? Of course! The toys are dangerous if you're not careful, but they are very poorly made. A loud bark at close range will destroy their cheap electronics. What about my brothers and sisters trapped in the crates? Try tumbling into the crates. You should be able to smash them open and rescue the puppies inside. Thanks, Waddlesworth. I'll see you soon. So, this is the parrot that will be throughout the game. And he's like a checkpoint guy, whatever. You can save your game there. And, yeah. I can go ask him something again, but... It was, he'll say the same things or something like that. First of all, I want to check the options to see if my controls are already there. So yeah, I jump the space bar, blah, 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 it's okay. I can either play with the uh, domino or... What's her name? I forgot it. Help me guys, help me remember this 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 puppy's name i forgot i i always played with her when i was a little child but now i forgot so yes um what am i supposed to oh no no toys oh my god toys used to scare the shit out of me okay Woo! i'm getting the bones and there is my little help for this level I forgot her name, it's a squirrel that I will be meeting again in the third level or fourth, no, third um, and you usually get uh, one character like this to help you throughout the level so let's hear what she has to say Oh, hi there, my name's Fidget, Fidget. My mom calls me that because well, I never stop moving <laughs> Nice to meet you, Fidget. There's a lot of fun stuff to do around here, but, but look out for those evil toys. If you have any questions, you just come find me, and I'll tell you what I know. Bye now. He's so cute. So, I won't be getting the food now because maybe I'll get injured. Food helps uh, when injured, but I will take the bones. It's 
sniff around. What the fuck? Please contact me, me on Skype. Yeah, remind me next time. In the next part, I will be closing all my programs. I forgot to close Skype. So here's a monkey. Let's kill it. And here's a puppy. You can break the box by rolling. Yay! More bones. Yippee! Also, there are... um Um... Hidden bones, they're buried. So I don't know if we have any here. There should be. Oh, yeah. You scratch it up. But um, another bone. So let's see what's happening here. No oh, more food. I don't need it. These guys are the worst. I hate these cars. They're so evil. Just, just hear them out. Hear them out. They see you from a distance and they come to you. Check out the awesome graphics, guys. Bam! Oh, let's hear what Fidget was her name has to say. Listen to those busy bees up there. Hey, I don't know if you found Cruella's henchman Jasper yet, but when you do, bring him back to my tree. I bet we could play a funny trick on him. <laughs> See you later. Okay, so more bones. When I was a little child, I used to like travel through the throughout the game faster by just rolling another dog thanks for rescuing me run away monkey i'm gonna kill it i killed it sniff i i think there's some, yes a buried bone you know it and sniffing always helps you if you don't know which way to go oh another bone it's sort of a hint thingy but it helps you find buried bones another one when you find a bone like this the mark is going to stay here so if you don't want to dig it up right now you can go throughout the game and then come back here you'll see this thing and you can bury it uh dig it later so 24 bones let's sniff some more Oh, found another one. As you can see, there are a lot of bones buried. Any more? Oh, bones right here. The scariest thing in this game is that on some levels, you get to see the henchmen which are uh, Casper or Chasper or something which is the the tall guy with long legs and he's kind of stupid I mean they all are except Lapelt who is this French guy who is the designer I think which designed Krilla's Oh, boat or something. I think. I think. It's been a long time since I played this game. So, what happens when Lapelt? Oh, not Lapelt. Uh, you see Casper or Chasper. I don't remember. He's right there, being an idiot. And you have to go there and make him see you. He'll go like, there's that little puppy or monkey or midget or whatever and you have to run up to the tree where you talked with fidget or midget or what was her name this part always scared me 
there is that mutt. Okay. So he's coming. And there should be a cinematic starting right about now. Yes. Come back here, you mutt! Okay, Fidget, now what? You gotta make him dizzy! One dizzy baton coming up! Now I gotcha! Oh, look out for his neck! I'm looking, I'm looking! That should do it! So stupid. Look at his face. Alright, you! And Just now... Real still come on, come on, do it, do it! And now, for the Coupe de Grosse. Uh-oh. Yo! I guess Jazz forgot the point. In the end. <laughs> <laughs> that was fun. So I got a sticker, yay! Let's talk to Fidget. Taking care of? Do you suppose he could do me a favor? Huh? Well, sure. What is it? Oh, I, I lost my favorite nuts. I go searching for it, but my mom doesn't let me go very far from our tree. <laughs> if you find it, would you please bring it back to me? You yeah, lip cinch. <laughs> so we got the henchman, and we're going to help this squirrel girl, fidget, whatever. So I hope you enjoyed this little part of this level, um, do us a favor, subscribe, like us, appreciate our videos, cause we'll be doing a lot of stuff and we hope to entertain you cause this is Randomly Cosmotic, see you in the next part.